I just picked up a hoagie from my local Primo Hoagies. If you're not from Philly, you might have one that's kind of close to you because they are in other states. And I ordered turkey and cheese, oil, and when the order gets repeated back to me, oh, you want turkey, cheese, mayo. I said, in, in what universe does oil sound like mayo? Oil, mayo. Okay, I'm not having a good week, guys. Here is my super healthy dinner. My Primo Hoagie. Feast your eyes on this, guys. We got turkey, American cheese, onion, oil. Just checking to make sure that there's nothing in here uh, mysterious that's not supposed to be here. So if you got a Primo near you, I highly recommend checking them out. Okay, guys, I have a small unboxing. I have to confess, I cheated. I bought something on the real real. I don't know what made me go browsing. I said I wasn't going to shop there anymore, but this item popped out and popped up, I should say, and I just had to have it. So I'm just going to get right into the box. It's been here for a few days. I just haven't gotten around to unboxing it. So I thought that I would just unbox it with you guys. So. I like the real, real boxes because they are really good to ship things in. And I'm going to need some shipping boxes for the holiday. So, yeah, this is going to come in handy. So, we have our item in a dust bag. Nothing else here. And let's get into the item. I don't need one of these, but I saw it and I couldn't help myself. And I have an agenda cover. This one is from Longchamp. It's the Fouline leather and it's really, really nice. It should have, it should have a stamp. Here it is. It's Stamp Longchamp. I don't think that they make these anymore. Um, there's a little tiny bit of wear right here at the corner. But nothing major. It's actually... No, you know what? It's raw edge. There's no glazing on this. Only where the pockets meet. The rest of this is just the raw edge. So that's fine. I really don't see any wear on this no it looks looks fine so this looks to be an a5 size i'm going to check it out and tomorrow i'll be able to show you if my a5 notebooks will fit in this but i got this for a really good price i know i was going to use it they're pretty pricey you know full price and i got it for an excellent deal so I just couldn't pass it up. One day I will go through how I'm setting up my planner for YouTube for 2023. And maybe some of it might be helpful for you guys. We'll see. Um, I have some ideas so far since it started in December. I've been kind of going through December and putting some things in. But I really want to get it completely set up for January. So... Yeah, this is it. Nice little usable object, and I'm going to go check it out now and see what fits. Well, there wasn't a whole lot happening today. You saw, like, the most exciting part of my day, which was running out to get this hoagie. Um, I showed the hoagie, and that's kind of it. So let's move on to the advent calendars. So I'm going to do the Sabon calendar first. And what are we up to? Day nine? I think we're up to day nine. Guys, this is pitiful, but I hear that poor baby outside and he's just really banging to come in. Oh, it breaks my heart. But my friends are coming over this weekend and we're gonna see how he does after being in here for a few minutes. So this is day nine. 
And it's a similar package to, I think it was yesterday. So it's a jar and it's another body scrub. This is my favorite scent from Sabon, or at least I should say it's the first one that I had, the Patchouli Lavender Vanilla. And this is an amazing, amazing fragrance. I mean, they do make this in a perfume. It's fabulous. It, you can wear it all year round, but I think that it's more of a cooler month kind of scent. So this is again, a body scrub, salt-based, and I've used this before, it's amazing. So I'm happy about that. And let's get into, uh, where are we at, day nine? Here we go. Oh, at least I spotted it quick. Please be good, please be good, please be good. All I want is a good chocolate. Is it too much to ask for? Oh, yeah, yeah, must be. All right, now I push the door in. Here we go. Well, it's another one of these. Oh, no. Oh, this is something different. This is a chocolate pyramid. And I'm not a million percent sure what this is. Okay. It is, do you hear that poor baby? Oh, I don't know. I'm gonna have to read through this list because they don't really number them. You have to kind of go in order and by the shape and it's all in French. So here we go. Today's chocolate, it's decent. I mean, it's going to take me more than one bite probably to eat it. So I'm just can't, kind of feeling blasé today, guys. What could I say? <sighs> now I'm probably not going to be. Oh, uh, here we go. Here we go. It's opening. Ta-da! So it's this little pyramid. It's got to be filled with ganache. It is. Mm, very good. That's what it'll put to inside. Okay. Pretty good. Mmm. Now I have my mouth full. So, so for today, tomorrow, I have no idea what we're going to do tomorrow, but I should have some pretty good vlogs over the weekend. So, tune in. I will see you guys later. Bye.